Heidi Wiles fills out forms Tuesday morning to get two of her children registered for River Oaks Elementary's first school year. I think it's exciting. I think the kids are really going to have a great opportunity with the um, with the new things in the classroom and you know, just everything being fresh and new and exciting. While sons attend an Ocean Bay Elementary School with 1,200 other students last year. At the new school, there will be half as many. The kids are going to get much more one-on-one -on -one with their teachers. They're not going to feel rushed as much. Sometimes they had to share the gymnasium with other classes at Ocean Bay, and they won't have to do that here. So it made really three nice sized schools. The principal, Dr. June Moorhead, says there are minor touch ups being made to the building, but overall, the school is ready to open. I've been in education 34 years, and I have never seen a happier, more excited staff. We met all summer in small groups, large groups to plan for the year. While developing ideas for the new River Oaks Elementary School, the school district decided it would be a green school, which incorporates energy efficient ideas not only in the construction of the building, but also in the classroom. We have solar panels uh, outside. We have a teaching turbine, a wind turbine. Our uh, playground equipment's recycled. Everything you can think of, we have a green curriculum. Uh, that we're uh, adding into our regular curriculum. The green curriculum will teach students to be more environmentally friendly while breaking in the new school. It's really interesting. It's like going to be all new. In Horry County, Amy Vitrano, News 13.